In this work, we present the first text-based video editing approach that lets editors insert new text in addition to cutting, copying, and pasting the existing transcript text. Our approach allows editing at any point and synthesizes the corresponding correct lip-synced video. Okay. The market closed today with Apple's stock price at $191.45 per share. Here we replace 91.4 with 82.2. Okay. The market closed today with Apple's stock price at $182.25 per share. Given a video of a talking head and a transcript of the speech, we first align the transcript to the video at the level of phonemes. We also register a 3D parametric face model with the video. Given any edit operation, we perform a Visim search to find the best match between subsequences of phonemes in the edit and the input video. This step gives us parameters of our face model which we further blend to obtain temporally coherent edits. We use these to synthesize a lower face region and combine it with the input to create a composite. To bridge the domain gap between the composites and real video footage, we use a neural face rendering approach. This gives us the final edited video. We now show more text-based editing results. We can add new words in a sentence. O Romeo, Romeo, wherefore art thou Romeo? Here we replace wherefore art thou with why are you. O Romeo, Romeo, why are you Romeo? And here's another edit. I love the smell of napalm in the morning. I love the smell of French toast in the morning. Note that the synthesized words were not spoken by the subjects in the training video. The audio of the new words were separately recorded. We also provide examples using a synthesized voice. I got fascinated by neural networks. Here we show the retrieved frames which were used to synthesize the mouth motion. I got fascinated by neural networks. Even though these frames come from different parts of the video and are not temporally coherent, our method produces temporally smooth outputs. I got fascinated by neural networks. We can also synthesize audio using text-to-speech systems like the VOCO system of Gene et al. In this example, the audio for ice creams was generated using VOCO. She sells ice creams by the seashore. We can also delete words. Learning from examples and, and scientists over the last few decades. Learning from examples and scientists over the last few decades. After. Why yell or worry over silly items? Why yell over silly items? Our results can be seamlessly composited into the original video sequence which allows us to edit videos of arbitrary resolutions. She sells ice cream by the seashore. In addition to such edits, we can also synthesize full sentences just from text to give a virtual assistant a face. She sells ice cream by the seashore. Here we again show the frames where the face model parameters were retrieved from. She sells ice cream by the seashore. She sells ice cream by the seashore. Did you hear about the crook who stole a calendar? No, I did not. Full sentence synthesis enables our method to be used for video translation. Here, we enable our non-German speaking subject to speak German. Ich spreche Deutsch. MorphCut is a video transition tool in Premiere Pro for removing jump cuts that is based on the work of Bertusso et al. In our setting, MorphCut produces artifacts as it requires the transition to be in a relatively static part of the video. So deep learning is inside machine learning. It's one of the approaches to machine learning. So deep learning is inside machine learning. It's one of the approaches to machine learning. 
learning from examples and scientists over the last few decades have about learning from examples and scientists over the last few decades have... Furthermore, MorphCut cannot be used to composite short segments and thus cannot be used to blend our retrieved video sequences. Okay. The market closed today with Apple's stock price at $182.25 per share. Okay. The market closed today with Apple's stock price at $182.25 per share. We compare our neural face rendering network to deep video portraits of Kim et al. As this approach does not perform text-based editing, we compare in a self-reenactment setting where a test sequence is reproduced. Note, for fairness, we train the approach using our recurrent generator network. Deep video portraits cannot deal with dynamic background or even dynamic foreground such as the motion of the hands or the shirt. Our method handles these challenging scenarios well. We also synthesize a higher quality mouth region compared to Kim et al. Our approach synthesizes a higher quality and temporally more stable mouth region than face-to-face -face of Thies et al. Without our parameter blending strategy, results are temporally incoherent. The market closed today with Apple stock price at $182.25 per share. We blend the parameters of the face model in every transition region. This leads to realistic looking motion which is well aligned to the edited text. The market closed today with Apple stock price at $182.25 per share. I got into neural networks. I got into neural networks. Here we evaluate result quality with respect to the size of the dataset. I love the smell of French toast in the morning. I love the smell of French toast in the morning. I love the smell of French toast in the morning. I love the smell of French toast in the morning. Best results are obtained using the full dataset. The quality of results degrades gracefully with the size of the dataset. We evaluate the realism of our results by performing a web-based user study. We asked users to rate the realism of source videos, which we want to edit. The dingo ate your baby. Real reference videos where the subjects speak the edited sentences. The dingo ate my baby. And edited videos obtained using our approach. The dingo ate my baby. She sells seashells by the seashore. She sells ice cream by the seashore. She sells ice cream by the seashore. Our results were considered realistic by more than half of the participants. Thank you for watching.